Hey everyone, Paul Zagorski here for PZ Guitar, your virtual practice partner. Today, more practice. This is we, we are all about practice, and today is another spider drill. So stick around. Let's practice. Hey, we're back. Paul here with another spider drill. So today's spider drill, we're going to be hanging around the fifth fret, and we're just going to go from the E string to the high E string, and then back up to the low E string. And what we're going to do is first finger is going to live on the fifth fret, second finger is going to live on the sixth, ring finger is going to live on the seven, and pinky is going to live on eight. But we're going to alternate fingers here. So we're going to do the following. It's going to be index. It's one, three, two, four. And then we skip a string until we get all the way down to the high E. And then we do the high E again, go to the B, and we go all the way back up. And we're just going to live in this particular area. So that's all we're going to do here. If you want to go up and travel down the fretboard, go right ahead. If you want to use the dusty end of the fretboard because you paid for it, might as well use it, go right ahead. If you want to stretch your fingers out a little bit more, start in position number one. But right now, we're just going to start off in position five, and we're going to live here. So let's go, get ready to go. I got a stopwatch here. We're gonna do this for a couple of minutes. Are you ready? Here we go. High E again. B, hot low E again. High E again. Low E again. High E again. You know the drill. Go back down. One more time. Excellent. Stick around for the recap, and I'll give you some final tips. And we're back. Thanks a lot for sticking around and doing yet another spider drill. Spider drills are very, very useful. They're very good. They're great things to warm up with. They're good things to make part of your particular, of your normal practice routine. It works on your finger dexterity. It works on your coordination between uh, between uh, fretting hand and strumming hand. Uh, you can work on your alternate picking up, down, up, down. 
Uh, it's, it's just a wonderful thing to try and do. Uh, and there are a lot of different variations. Like I had mentioned earlier, you could start off on, uh, in position one, and then you can shift up to fret number two as you go down and go back up. You can go all the way up to the fretboard. You can live on, on fret, number, uh, fret number five. You can start at fret number seven and do there because the frets are a little bit closer. If you want to stretch your fingers, start at position number one. But do it for a couple of minutes every day. I think, personally, I think you should do one of the, of the, of the types of Sparta drills at least once a day. That should be part of your practice regimen. Remember, this is practice. And this will pay dividends, I guarantee you. So again, thanks a lot for sticking around. Put a like in, uh, subscribe to the channel. Put a like down if you, um, if you like the video. Put a comment in as to what other kinds of drills or other types of practice sessions you might want to try and do. Again, spider drills should be part of your DNA. So until the next time, keep practicing.